Hello people of YouTube, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another round of golf on pixelated golfers. Uh, just noticed the uh, the leaderboard there, first round, crooky 12 under. <whistles> ah, I made a mistake actually. Right, let's crack on. Again, this is preparation for this week's um, Corn Ferry Tour. Uh, when I went out my bike today, I actually went to Halfords to get, um, initially to get a, a, a chain stay protector from a bike. It basically just stops chain slap because when you're on like the, the one of the kind of war gears, <coughs> excuse me, the chain's quite close to your, your what's called the chain stay. It's a, the part that goes from the, the pedal crank to the, the back of the, the cassette and it slaps off it. So it's just a, a neoprene guard you put over it. So I went to get that. Uh, I also got a, a torque wrench just for doing up sort of parts of my carbon fibre bike. You don't want to over, over torque them too much. And I picked up a tyre. I picked. I actually picked up a bottle cage for, for my other bike because I took the two off that one onto my new one. So, uh, but coming back, I had an incident with a a, a truck, a big side a articulated uh, lorry. Basically. Man, I, I, I tell you, I was almost wiped out. I mean, to say that I could have died, I mean, I, I know it sounds oh, kind of over-dramatising a little bit, but I, if, if I'd lost control, I, I would have been dead. I, I, I would honestly have been dead. The guy went by, I mean, he practically had no room. I must have had... see what happens today. I don't know how close it was, but, oh, jeez, man, it was close. I wish I had my, my GoPro running at the time because I'd actually have some form of evidence. Yards to the pin. But man, that was too close to call. But anyway, let's go on with this round. Let's try and let's try and get a double digit round. Okay, it's up how a little. Oh, that's a difficult that's a really difficult pin. I think I'm gonna hit this club. I think this might still be short. Do you know that? That's a very... Oh, that seemed like a bit of a weird swing. Distance-wise, it wasn't too bad. I just seem to come over it a little. I mean, the swing line's not... It's not maybe the best, but... <clears throat> so, yeah, this is the Corn Ferry Tour we're playing. Well, this, pr the practice point? for the, the Corn Ferry Tour. 176. Now these conditions I think are default. That might be short. <clears throat> I kind of had my visualisation for that, that putt length, but yeah, I kind of chickened out. The sun was and catching the back of the, the putter. Par. Yeah, it's quite a scary bike ride actually. I actually enjoyed the bike ride. I did about eight miles there and back. Felt good after, but yeah, that it was towards the end of my ride as well. I was almost home, and it was just a big kind of coal truck. There's a lot of coal trucks that go round this area. I'm not going to say the name uh, of the company, but jeez, I, I tell you, man, it, it keeps. I'm almost getting flashbacks. It, it was so, it was so bad. Let's see what happens. I mean, oh man, I did pull into the bus lane a little bit just to come back out. I, I don't know, I just took a little bit of a breather, just to go off the road for like two seconds. But maybe that was my mistake. But maybe that saved me as well. I, I, don't, I really don't know. Scary, really scary. One sixty, slightly downhill. Hmm. That wind's quite strong. <clears throat> and here's an eight iron. Yeah, it's turning too much, I think. <coughs> ah, excuse me, wow. No, but I've actually got a decent pop from there. Best approach shot. I'm gonna assume the wind had something to do with that. So my philosophy is double-digit golf. 
Basically, if you can hit double digits, you'll do well in TGC tours. Mm, I'm sure it's going to break a little bit more. Yep. That tricky putt actually was a lot of break on that putt. And this putt could save par. Solid putt. And he's going to stay right where he is. So there's Crookie, 2 under par, 14 under total. Um, Crookie, 72. Uh, I think it's, uh, is it Robert Crookshanks, I believe his name is. Um, he actually missed a cut by a single shot last week, which was kind of heartbreaking. Because um, it was at 9 under par for quite, quite a period of time. Uh, and it just changed. Just changed probably the last couple of hours of the, the 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 tournament. Yeah, Robert Crookshanks. As I say, it's the same name as my mum's side of the family. Uh, Crookshanks. So it's a name that I'm kind of familiar with. In fact, when I seen Crookie, I probably really should have realised that that was that's what his name was. But um, yeah, yeah. I mean, he was close, but he's he's going well on this one. So it's kind of setting the pace for me. And next up is a but he plays in course. the Corn Ferry Tour, which is quite good. You can relate to somebody. Oh, that's. <sighs> I'm going to take a punt at this. Purely because. I don't know if it's possible to get to the green, but I'm going to just have a. I'm going to have a blast. I feel that I'm not... Mm, it's not bad, actually. It's not a bad place to be. It's one of those shots. It's like a shot to nothing. <coughs> oh, I need a drink of water, actually. My throat is, is gets that really tickly weight. Ah, oh, it's better. Right. Probably do a flop here. Mm. Percentage is kind of weird. I feel this can maybe come out a little bit hot. If it rolls a little. Yeah, a little bit of roll. Maybe should have went with the other club. And about 13 feet away here. This is looking quite good. <coughs> that should be a birdie. birdie. Easy hole that. That that's that's a that's a guaranteed birdie really. Right, one under part. Colin Jin Lover's not playing too well. 16 over. I don't know if he's... I don't think he's played as poor as that in previous tournaments. It's a name I've, I've seen before. Maybe he's too much gin. Right, let's go. Let's continue. Now the fourth hole. I mean, it's not... I, I think it's going to... It's one of those courses that it's kind of set itself up for a, for a decent tournament. I don't think it's like, terribly difficult. Um... Mm, this is a kind of. Well, it's 200. It's probably playing about 192. Look, I'm going to play the 183 here. Maybe just a little bit of D loft. And here's oh, that's the way out there. My swing line's really weird. It's kind of off a little bit. Not the best approach Maybe I'm sitting a bit today. funny. Unfortunately, not enough club. I know I it's. I know it's Sometimes you do get out of position. Just trying to kind of maybe adjust my my why here. Don't, oh. Ah, oh, not a bad piece. It could, it could have been. It could have been a good chip in there. It's about six feet to go here. Yeah, that's my, that's my, no, I wouldn't say it's a problem, it's just one of those putts that you kind of, this one's about 10 feet from the too cup. much pace, for that line that should have been a, a soft putt. <coughs> Good putt back though, nah, that's just a mistake. 
And after that hole, uh, he's going to go up to even par. That's even. And setting up for the par 5 hole. This one's quite tricky. To be heading for the fairway here. So yeah, a little bit of time to reflect on the weekend's performance. Um, disappointing in, in TGC tours. Uh, just, I mean, you know, we did enough. We, we scraped by without a, a demotion strike, but it was close. But I mean, it. it I don't know. It's a. It, it was a difficult course. I thought. Probably should have played a lesser club so I had a, a better club into the green, but that's if it holds a fair weight. Can we kick over? Nah. That's a mistake. I can't see him being uh, oh. happy about that. Yeah, I'd probably rather play a full shot than a than a pitch. You okay? I think she's okay. Oh, that that oh that could be good actually. E whoa! Yes, yeah, so it just trickles on. With all these greens are quite quite fast. I mean that was probably looking to be a really good shot, but it just didn't bite in as much. Feet. Yeah, there's a little bit of break. Quite, quite, quite hard. A wee bit softer, that might just have caught the edge. And they're going to stay steady right where they were. Right, so still even. Sixth place in the standings after that one. Crookie's still two under through 12. Pop's daddy was only three under through seven, so it's, I wouldn't say the course is played. Yeah, moving on to the a little bit tricky. I think that wind's quite tricky. Man, my swing line's not... I don't know, it's a little bit off. <clears throat> Make the fair weight and you have a drink. Ugh. From 140 yards out. So I thought I was actually... <coughs> oh, my throat's getting really bad. I thought it was actually off tomorrow, but I'm actually in. I don't know whether that was changed, because that's kind of weird. I was actually looking forward to another day off, to be honest. 138, so it's 131. Uh, yeah, I'll probably go with that. I'll probably loft up. Yeah, I kind of emphasised my technique there a little bit. Well, I don't emphasise it. I just really caught, looked at how I was swinging. That's a better swing. And this pot is for birdie. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I drink. It's just it's tickly. Setting up for this next tee off. Wind could be an issue here. Let's see. Uh, we've got 25. It's roughly about 8. 144. I'm going to choke down in this club a little. Another weird angle. Not a bad shot though. <coughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me, sorry. Trying to hit the button there, but I'm covering my mouth as well.
Ja. Kurs. Have been missing a lot of putts though. Like just, I mean, like just, just that kind of thing, burning edges. So Crookies went back to one under. Pop's daddy was two under. Again, the scoring's not super low. And now the eighth hole. Just what we need to get a run going here. Uh, this is. Yeah, we have to shape this hole. I'll we'll shape this shot, sorry. Well, I've had it a fast. Which is going to promote the, the draw even more, but that could be good if it gets a good kick. It's not bad. It's one of those holes that's kind of designed in a way that it, it kind of. It kind of helps you a little bit. Pretty sure he's gonna like that one from 115 yards out. This is a kind of money shot here. This really should be all over this. Okay, that's another bit of a weird swing. Short. I mean, for that distance, that should be absolutely like within a inside ten ten foot easy. Yeah, just in the line. And to save the par. That's a par. And after that one, with that right distance, in should be should be an easy uh, birdie from there. And now setting up for the next par four hole. <coughs> Might play us with a bit of fader actually. Play the old Darth fader. Uh, that's maybe cutting too much over. Might be okay. Yep. Friendly bounce. And about 175 yards away here. Mm, 17. Pull a bit off that hill should take a bit off it as well. Looks like a Again, I'm not not, not on line here at all. I think the angle I'm sitting at, or just the angle I've got my controller's not good. And missing the approach on that one. A bit too much club on that one. So I'll be making those adjustments mid round to maybe if you have got a bit of a swing issue. I mean, nothing really like. Nothing terrible, but it's gonna run by a little. Oh, come on! Yeah, a bit of a mistake there. I really should have noticed that there was a bit of a downslope after the the hole. Twenty-eight feet to the cup from here. It's a kind of classic mistake. Come on, turn a little. I did it, Tom. Oh, good length, good speed, but just did not turn. This putt is for bogey. Yeah, that's a that's that's a run killer. That that's that's, that's your momentum. Just goes. And that hole's gonna Especially put at, at that kind of that point, like the mid round point. For sixth place on the leaderboard. So we're still even part. Okay, and the tenth hole. We just haven't got going. Six iron. 
Swing line is quite funny today. I kind of always knew that was going to be long. I was, I was actually thinking of going 160, but That's just, uh, that may have been the better call. On that approach. Too much club, I think. Uh, I didn't hit it. Had the line in that, but just didn't hit it. This one's about six feet away. <sighs> You're finishing this one with a good putt. Frustrating. And after that one, they'll stay right where they are in sixth place. <sighs> and now setting up for the par four tee off. <clears throat> I don't know, I think it's... Well, I mean, it is downhill. Do you know what? I'm just going to go for it. I think worst case scenario would be in the bunker area, roughly. And he's ended up wow. in the water here, unfortunately. <laughs> so that was a risk. We're actually going to get back to it. Mm. Yep. Doesn't really matter where we are, I don't think. I think in the tournament, I don't think I would do that, to be honest. It's, it's, it's one of those kind of shots. If the wind's right, I suppose. 100 yards. What am I doing, man? I'm hitting... Come on, get up there. Nah, we're going to be putting at least, but... Oh. Yeah, mistake off the tee, really. They can save par. Good putt, though. Finishing Good this save. Solid putt. And he's going to stay right there at even par after that hole. Cookie's five under. He's also tied for six. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Whoa. What is happening me? I don't know what's happening with Colin Jen. Is, is there, a, is there a, some kind of scoring error in this game at the moment? Somebody posted on one of the community groups on Facebook that he was like some stupid like 50 odd over par. I don't know if that's the same thing. Swing's not there today. That's a so. Uh, it's a bit weird. Right, we'll just we'll weigh up with a shot that's going to give us. Something attempting a, a full shot into the green. And back into the short stuff after that one. And it's about a 105 yard shot to the pin. Uh, excuse me. Right, this should be really good. This should, this should be close. Yeah, it's not bad. <coughs> I'm trying if I put waft on it. Oh, this cough's really bad. I do apologise. Oh, I did not hit it. Oh, my goodness. And for the par. Oh, should have been a bad day. Oh, it's really it's frustrating. Right there at sixth place in the standings after that hole. That's Crookie going to win. 
to. I think he'd be happy with that score. 17 under par. That would probably definitely make the cut by a couple of shots at the margin. This is actually a very... 213. It's almost like 10 up. It's like 9. So it's going to be... 222 yards to the pin. That wind as well. Just going to ask full beans because it, it's... A partial shot would probably have been better. But... Yeah, I just can keep running. I thought I may get a little bit of roll off for of this slope, but well, yeah. I'm actually didn't think it was going to be as much rollback as that, but because a partial shot yeah, is man, it's risky with that pin position. That's a difficult, difficult pin position. Come on. Come on. Ah. So just missed. Close. Oh, it's just trickling on, look. Oh, could I maybe went for that too much? And about 16 feet left to go. Kind of an easy pop one. back, though. And after that hole, he will stay at even par. Oh, still even. Again, if this was like TGC Tours mode, I would not be happy at this moment. I'd be really like sweating bullets because I don't know what the cut line would be. I, I reckon it's going to be maybe double digits, 11, 12 under maybe. Yeah, swing. Our swing is just not there today. So I coughed and I pressed that button. And he won't be too pleased with that. Right, Thirteen off that. Six three wins gonna bring it back up. It's the rough. I'm gonna go one nine four. It's not gonna hit a hope really. Ah, short. <sighs> kind of a tough one to judge that, to be honest. This is downhill as well. The percentage. Well, see what I mean? Evan's just running on. It's chasing on from the rough. I mean, that looked like... Initially, when it landed, it looks like it was going to be sort of pretty decent. It just trickles feet. on. There's really much in this. This shot might Did be hit it? a perfect shot, folks. Oh my oh goodness! My goodness. Close. Very oh, it's so frustrating. Uh, nothing's really connected this round. I did actually play a few warm-up holes on the Crystal the Lake, board. which is a Halloween. Um, one, down, golf course, quite a, quite a tough on course actually. Plus one. Up, we have a par five hole. So this round ain't going so well. Why? Well, I think my swing's just not there. That's a better. That's a better hit. That's a better swing line. The other swing lines have been kind of iffy. Ah, I mean, I'm probably going to say this again. There was a, a couple of rounds I played, like, maybe a couple of weeks back. And then prior to that, there was rounds where some days you come on this and you just cannot hit your usual shot. Now, whether that's like a... I don't know whether that's like a... Some kind of... I don't know, server issue... But you just feel that you're never really swinging the way you, 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 usually, ooh, you usually swing. Get up that slope. 
and that. <clears throat> and it just happens sometimes. I think the, the tournament that I won on TGC Tours, I played like my first. Okay, and hitting this par five, did I play my first two, second round? I went to play on Friday. Definite eagle and it just wasn't there. I, I played a few practice rounds and it just wasn't. I don't know, it just wasn't there. Well, look at this putt. This putt's horrendous. <sighs> Gee whiz. Now I think. If if I if I know the rules, is it not over? If the putt's over a hundred foot, or is it ninety something feet? You can chip in the greens. Man, this is this is super difficult. This is a super difficult putt. This is uncharted territory here. Really, you just want to get up over that hill. It's not bad from there, to be honest. It's not great either, but it's not bad. Yeah, but I actually, I, I played that day, and I, I played a couple of rounds, and my swing line, I don't know whether I was hitting fast or slows, or just the swing line was kind of dirty. There was just something that day that I just couldn't put my finger on. And I didn't play. Nah. Mm -hmm. And I just pulled the plug on it. And I played my two rounds on Saturday, I believe. For the par. I'm sure it was the one that I won. Um, it just wasn't there. And after that whole one over for the day. Still plus one. Put him yeah, Colin Jen Lovers had a... On the leaderboard. I don't know what's happening there. I don't know if that is. I, he's not played as bad as that before. I'm kind of interested to find out what's actually happened there. Because that's like an obscene amount. I mean, even playing, even playing really poor. It's looking like it's heading is, is he really actually like glitched in the golf course? And maybe. I, I don't know. I, I, that's kind of weird. But yeah, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, the swing line there's just not—it's not on the money. Play a well by a draw here, just to hold it in that wind. Ah, uh, needs to get a good the kick. Bound for the beach, folks. Ah, got a decent wide on the bunker. But yeah, I, I just think the game sometimes. I don't know. I don't know whether it's maybe just me, but I think it can be it can be off sometimes. Uh, what have we got? Um, yeah, it's really strange. It, it, it's. It's really sensitive, bunker, you know. It's not. Is quite possible. I don't know. I can't put my finger on it. For birdie, and he's gonna move up in the standings after that hole. Hey, at least we're back to even par. So let's try and finish at least under par. Crookie's finished. Oh, actually, I, I, I didn't see that. Crookie's actually one shot ahead of Pop Stadio, who has finished. So they only shot six under par. At seven under par, score there's the lowest. That's not a lot. That's that's like a that's like an average uh, round. So it must be playing. It must be playing quite. As uh, well to me, I think it's playing quite tough. Is there maybe issues with the the, the swing? You know, and that's why people are not scoring as well. Oh, come on. <coughs> I keep me to hit that button when I cough, but... One. This is difficult. Oh, 
Yeah, Swingway's not. Going right through that. Oh, that's so short. Oh my goodness. This is not. This is not a good. Uh, a good round to be posting. But to be honest, I've, I've said it before. That's my game. I, I, I post. If I play terrible, then there's a lot of people wouldn't post that up to the YouTube channel. But you know, if I play bad, I put my hand up, and I just you know it's like yep, I've played poor. I don't know why. I think the swing line is a little bit iffy. My technique's the same. I'm not really changing anything. It's just one of those things. That's going to run on a little. That's not a bad shot. But yeah, I just put my hand up. I post it up as well because I think you can that learn from like, poor rounds. And after that hole, he will stay. At so we're still the even. He's heading up the last hole. For sixth place on the leaderboard. Disappointing rounds, to be honest. But I, I do feel the swing is. I don't know. There's just something that's not not there. It's hard to put your finger on it. That's a bit better. It's going straight at it. Come on, be good. Get in the hole. Oh, get in the hole. Ooh. Oh, it's going to run by a little. Okay, at least we know it breaks there. And that approach is on the green, but uh, quite quite lengthy putt ahead. Come on, let's try and sink this. Come on. Nah, just the whole side. That one's, uh, that's too bad. <sighs> it's been a tricky course today. Greens have been... I yeah, think the greens have been really fast. I, I try and think what the green speed was yesterday. For the actual tournament conditions. Oh, I thought that too hard. Oh. oh my goodness, that's a train wreck. This one's about two feet from the cup. Yeah, that's a par three. Oh, bogey. So we actually do finish over par. How many times I finish over par? Eh... Uh, not much to say about that, to be honest. Uh, well done to Crookie, who is, at the moment, the, the leader of the tournament. Uh, looks like he is going to take the, the title. I don't know if there's anybody else, maybe, still to play the rounds, but... Yeah, that's a bit of a... Not a good... One, two... Th only three birdies. And what did we have? We had one, two... Four bogeys, so... Not really a lot happening, not a lot of birdies. Uh, missed a couple. Missed a couple of putts that could have been birdies, but... Yeah, poor play, to be honest. Yeah, it's not one of my best rounds, I think. I'm not I'm not really even wanting to blame the game, I just... I don't know, swing line was just a bit... A bit messy. Yeah, I need to get a drink of water here before I, I start croaking. But yeah, not much to say in that round. As I say, it's not one of my best, but I will post it because that's 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 what I do. I play, I play poor, I post it. I don't hide. I don't hide behind a, you know, Mr. Fantastic cape. If I play poor, I play poor. I put my hand up. <clears throat> so that concludes the Pro-Am. I need to think about the tournament for tomorrow, for the one round Wednesday, and then a weekend tournament. So I'm probably going to think about that. I'm really starting to... I really need a pee now. <laughs> Uh, it's getting emotional. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching. It's greatly appreciated. Again, click the subscribe button if you if you if you haven't subscribed already, uh, and hit it with a like as well. It's greatly appreciated. And any comments, if you want to drop a comment, feel free. It's greatly appreciated. And I will see you for more videos coming up soon. And I need a pee. Bye.